Hey everyone, it's your favorite monkey and welcome back to Starbase. Um, just doing actually a quick stream, believe it or not, for those who are watching on YouTube. Um, right now I am just, you know, trying to stream, see what is going for what. If you guys don't know, um, I have been having issues with my stream recently. And now I'm testing it out by doing a relay of some sort. Uh, from you know South African servers like I'm streaming to a server and that server relays it to a twitch server so basically that's what I'm doing it all looks fine and dandy uh, now it just said it went live so anyways um I hope you guys do, do enjoy this type of um, content you know like my face you, sh you can see uh, other than that um, pro people are probably going to watch this vlog like what the hell is he talking about no it's, I'm like talking about myself uh, but yeah, also, eh, stupid hats. Also, uh, make sure to check out my Twitch channel if you haven't already. There will be a link down in the description. Um, and uh, also, I think I will post my schedule there as well, like a link to my Twitch schedule, which you can check out to see when I am streaming. Uh, I am streaming every Tuesday and Thursday. I stream some um, Starbase. That's right. That's what I do. And uh, everything looks fine and dandy. It's just a damn shame. Oh, yeah, no, there we go. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, now, the thing is, this is literally a day, like 11 hours ago, they have done a couple of things, which really makes me happy. If you take a look over here, okay? Wow, I don't have any funds. Ha! Ah, I've probably got to do some mining again. Um, the cargo volume and voxel volume cargo volume is a new thing i don't i don't think i've ever seen that before but voxel volume has been doubled in size which is amazing really amazing i don't know if this area has been increased though um what i can probably do is whip out the ye old loxodonta wow almost 23 days ago because if you guys remember this was the yeah, the marked 1.3, that's it. Um, if you guys remember, what I've done with this ship is design a hauling ship. It's just, that's all it is. It's not a mining ship or anything. It's purely a hauling ship. And we've actually hit the voxel volume with this thing, which kind of made me sad. But now, since size is not an issue anymore, and uh, if we could check out the building budget... Okay, pipes is an issue. <laughs> pipes will be an issue. <laughs> oh boy. Um, cables not so... Although, have cables also been increased? No, cables have doesn't look like it. No, 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 no. That was always doubled. The uh, cables have been always been a double of that. So yeah, there's still like um, transporters I need to add and whatnot. But I'm happy about this. This is what I'm happy about. Like, yeah. This is going to work out beautifully. I love it. Um, that means we can finish up the plating back here. Okay, we can move these thingies. I don't know why is it. Why is this green? Why is this green? Like why you? <laughs> can we just like change that to something not ugly? Please and thank you. That that and that. There we go. Yeah. So we can finish up the plating here. Although, as I remember. This was supposed to be where our, uh, what do you call the, um, plasma thruster was supposed to go. Because this is exactly shaped out to house a plasma thruster. Now, how well this thing is, I don't know. I don't know. Man, I really wish, I think I still have the original skeleton of this ship. It's just beams, nothing more, nothing less. I could probably whip out its insides, um, just get everything out. And then uh, just add uh, ore crates then. I think that would be a great idea. Um, and just get rid of this, um, what do you call it, the uh, cargo lock frame. Just ta completely take that out. It's not going to be needed at all. Uh, and then just fill this thing up. Yeah, that's like, that's like literally the only thing that is needed. The only necessary thing is the uh, backplating here. Probably going to add back the plasma thruster to get rid of these platings, finish up the plating as it should be, and then fill up the rest with the voxel volume. Just the rest will be just 
you know, um, all of the ore crates, which would actually be pretty good. Now that I think about it. Dreamers are holding up actually pretty nicely. Really nice. Um, I think I should just up the bitrate maybe. Just see how far this baby can go. Uh, two, 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 four, maybe? I don't know. I limited it to 2,000. I wasn't too sure. Uh, but yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four fuel tanks. Uh, it's like since I built this thing, there's a lot of information I've gotten uh, about how big engine, how many engines you should use, and all those things. Uh, somebody even suggested adding roll to it, um, which I think is possible. I think it is. Um, also, this. Uh, okay, so this thing's center of mass, although over here, what are you complaining about? Uh, plate that is not attached to anything. That I do not like, but this, this is really crap plating, by the way, also. Um, and what else is up here that is not plated? What are you? Oh, you. Here we go. Camera thing! Please, maybe? Really? Oh, there we go. Uh, I think it just takes very long to update. Because of its sheer size. Um, also, what are you? Okay, that's you. That would be you. That, and what's up there? Oh, yes. We can just go ahead and... Boop. Be gone. Because we just want the one little square over there. And as we can see, this thing, its alignment is not ideal it's a uh, it's shape it's not ideal at all if you go ahead take a beam and this is the way i normally uh measure like if you're sh um like straight with the with the ship uh it's center of thrust and center of mass wait yeah center of thrust center of mass um the white one will be your center of thrust and that will be your center of mass uh ignoring those two and what i do is i just take a beam just step back way back because this is a giant ship and just do this and then we can see actually oh okay can i place it oh maybe we, if we move a little bit closer you know go up a little there we go nope nope there we go just move you up ever so slightly as we can see the center of thrust is nowhere near the center of mass Okay, but we have to remember, if we're going to add the plasma thruster back to this, okay, that's going to have some weight to it. And then if we add, if we complete the plating, that's going to add some extra weight. And if we're going to add the extra um, crates down here, inside here, then that should also add some weight, which should bring this thing down. I don't know if that works, you know? I don't know if it simulates, like, gravity or anything. Um, but as far as I understand, it takes the whole ship into account. And, like, where the most mass would be would be around here. In dead space, I don't know how you would call it. But it would be around there. Um, so that is a thing. And... Yeah. There's also... Mm, what happens if we quickly... The music's a little bit too loud. Let me just bring that down ever so slightly. I mean, I don't mind the audio. The music. It just needs to be consistent. There we go. All right. Uh, stream is still holding up. Beautiful. Uh, another thing... Okay, yeah. This is what I want to do is... Virtual mass. I just want to... Since we have those few ore crates in there, let's go ahead and add maximum mass and apply to all. Uh, yeah, it does nothing. <laughs> it does nothing at all. <laughs> it is nothing. <laughs> it's just too. It's just too funny. Like <laughs> this. This is nothing for this ship. This. Uh, this amount. <laughs> all right. No, but okay. I'm glad that the voxel volume has been increased. It. It brings me much joy. Much. Much joy. That is. That's like. Like what I've waited for. When. Uh. I. When I discovered voxel volume. I just. Uh, and I don't know, still don't know what to do with this top end of the ship. This thing. It's like, what What am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> Alright, no. 
Um, but let's go ahead and save this. I want to jump over to the Inquisitor because there's also something we need to do there. I want to check out. Um, because if we check out here, maximum cargo volume is that. Oh, well, why not? Why not showing out of? It should be out of sixteen. It sh it it has the same thing. Um, but yeah, it's not really what I was had in mind. Okay, you're done saving? Yes, you are done saving. Let's go ahead and open up the Inquisitor. And then afterwards, we can quickly just jump into designing a little bit on the um, mining ship I'm working on. I'm really curious about it. Like, really curious, like, how it would um, go about with the new the new changes. Um, how big are you, though? Uh, cables and pipes are, like, near limits, so that is fine. Um weaponry yeah okay we're not gonna add any more weapons to this thing warheads i wish i could um and yeah not too not too shabby not too shabby and this thing does have a uh what you will call the plasma thruster and as we can see the weight and everything is still perfectly aligned over there uh we can actually do we want to? Yeah, let's go ahead and delete these. We don't need them anymore. I just use them for target practice. So that, uh, goodbye. Bye. Not need anymore. Goodbye. Okay, so that and that is all good. Now that means we can keep this top cockpit. I just don't know. It's too big. I mean, if we quickly take a uh, a flight, a look, a look, see. Okay, let's go over here. All right, we're in here, and this is all fine. You know, this is. We have the amount of chairs needed to mount every weapon around here. I just thought I heard something. Yeah, we have everything. There's nothing more to add. So this is just wasted space. I don't know what to do. Although there might be we mounted weapons coming at some point. I don't know. I have no idea uh, when that will be launched. Uh, but still, it's fine. Um... Hey, Silvercoon. Uh, did you get everything worked out? Uh, if you mean by my um, streaming issues, or do you mean my Steam issues? My Steam has been resolved a few days ago after it got hacked. I mean, I wouldn't be playing this game at all. It's like, I would, that was what I worried about, because this is invite only. And those people had access to my Steam. Um, but... With the streaming thing, this is kind of what I'm testing, you know. I, was, I don't know how long I'm going to test, to be honest. Um, because we're, I'm just trying to... Your streaming issues... Oh, okay, so that's what you meant. <laughs> you probably didn't even know my... <laughs> um, what do you call it? The... Um, Steam. My Steam has been act before. And, yeah. But that got it uh, fixed. But, yeah, I'm like... I'm looking at the... Um, bit rate and everything it's not dropping to like really stupid low levels like it usually does I'm hoping it's working I mean can it no not can it all um, uh, Cage my moderator he posted something in my discord that showed me um, a troubleshoot guide on what to do so I did everything they said uh, but I felt like ah, that's not, that's not, I don't think that's going to cut it um, but I'm part of a group a discord group called ZA Streamers, where all the South African streamers would um, join together and, you know, share content and those kind of things. And what it turns out that there was actually something some South African streamers should do is um, if you don't have a very powerful connection, I mean, I'm, I kind of do sort of have like a 100 meg fiber line, a, a symmetrical, um, but apparently that wasn't enough. What South African streamers need to do, since there is no Twitch server in South Africa, or Africa for that instance, uh, we need to connect our connection, like my connection here. Uh, well, take it easy. I just thought I saw you and I was going to check before I head off to, to do some work. Oh, all right. Uh, sorry, I was trying to just explain. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. But yeah, but yeah, I think it's all sorted. Let's just put it that way. I think it's all sorted. Um, yeah, so, but thanks for dropping by. I do I do appreciate it. I didn't really expect you to, anybody to comment or be here at all. I just, you know, trying to do things. But yeah, thanks, man. I, I, I appreciate it and take it easy. I hope everything is fine and dandy on your side of the world. 
And there we go. Um, so those fuel rods are being used. Those batteries. And um, radiation rate is actually... Wait, 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 wait. 16, 11, 12, 22, no problem. Have a good night last. All right, Silver Queen, thanks for dropping by. Do appreciate it. Have yourself a good night, my friend. I will keep everybody informed what is going on. Uh, wow, why are you flickering like that? That is very interesting. What? Wait. All right, I'm just checking this radiation because this is weird. I'm bringing you back. Uh, all right, well, that's fine, I guess. Uh, we'll play with the main gun in a second. So um, for those who are watching on YouTube, um, what I was basically trying to say is that my connection at home, I have to connect to a thing in... No, oh, come back, come back. <laughs> <laughs> just forgot this thing fly forward. <laughs> oh, but it's slowing down a little. Um, but yeah, I have to connect to a server, uh, uh, some kind of some kind of server somewhere. I don't know exactly what server it is, but yeah, need to connect to that, and then after that, they send my stuffs over to like the real Twitch server um, called it's called Relaying, as far as I know. All right, so this is actually pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead and just, you know, play around a little. I mean, since we're here, let's go ahead and open up the side doors. It's going to open up the main door. Uh, get the generators to maximum. Switch on our range finder because we want to find our range. And let's go ahead and switch on the gun. The main gun. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 something in my eye. Oh, damn it. Don't you just hate it when that happens? You're, like, busy doing something and just something comes around like, Hello! Pokes you in the eye. Hate it. Hate it when that happens. Um, but yeah, if anybody I haven't seen, I've got a few videos where we made this bad boy. Oh, I love it so much. Uh, I just, I must probably go into the server, the Discord, the K-Bots. I'm, I'm just going to call them the Kabots. Because it's, the way I pronounce K-Bots, it sounds like something different. Um, I just have to find out from them. Like, what am I supposed to do to keep these guys sort of charged? Because they will drain batteries. The, um, rail guns, they will drain the batteries. There they go. They will drain them. Wait a minute. Why do you guys have fuel cells? Or do I only have radiators here at the front for the... Wait, I'm, I'm confused. What, what, what was I thinking? Let me just quickly go check something before we go to the uh, other ship. Um, you guys... You guys have a radiation meter and you as well. Why do I have fuel cells on these? There's no reason to have fuel cells. Oh, excuse me. Uh, yeah, there's no reason to have fuel cells. Now where is Zeus? You guys is uh, radiators. Yeah, back here. Yeah, this is where you are. Ah, huh, interesting. Okay, so that's kind of a design flaw. Although it's nice actually to have a few extra fuel cells. Um, just for in case like you, you your radiators get shot or something. So they are just there for backup, but... Uh, okay, cool. So... Yeah. Pretty cool. And I think I did set these guys so they don't hit those. And... Yep, they hit them. <laughs> they're not supposed to hit there. Uh, yeah, they're supposed to only go down that far. Oh, well. Whoever is uh, going to pilot these uh, should just make sure that... Whoa. That you don't hit the the uh, ship. And then obviously the ones at the uh, sides over here. Pretty cool. I love it. Get off the chair, man. Okay, great stuff. Let's get out of here. Um, I think that is that. 
and I'm like, uh, it's like I just wanted to check out like how the voxel volumes and everything. So I think you guys should prepare for future videos about us revisiting these ships, um, especially Loxodonta, because damn, that's, that's like a big ship, and I would really love to fly that thing around, um, and the Inquisitor to take it out into battle. Because there were some people who were saying that um, about plating and all those things, and I tried to tell them like we just have to. Keep in mind, the voxel volume is about to be hit with this thing. That was before this update. And we, like, I would have basically only protected this sh uh, part of the ship with um, extra plates coming down here at the back. But now, since the voxel volume has increased, I'm going to close off this area completely and that area over here as well. And, and it kind of makes some room for more batteries for this main cannon though which i mean it's, that's got to be a lot of batteries but it's still it's going to be pretty cool and yeah i also have to go figure out like these fuel cells and things for the plasma thrust how many rings do you have bro how many do you have one my god come on one two three that's a collar one, two, three. Okay, so you just only have three. And I think they pump out, what, 3.5 million thrust per ring or something? And then they double up at two seven mil when they're warmed up. So, yeah. And we could probably add rotation to this. Like, uh, it rolls. And it can sort of be easily done if we add just some box thrusters here. But that means we have to add some over here as well somewhere. Which I don't like. It's going to break the aesthetics of this. Oh well. Anyways, go ahead and save it uh, and jump to this uh, Zabimaru and see how that goes. How long have I been streaming? Is there like a timer? Yeah. Um, 20 minutes? Alright, we will go for about another 40 minutes or so and check out how that works. Uh, usually around the 2 hour mark is when I see issues with my stream. But this, this is breaking working brilliantly. Uh, Pathfinder, Star Shots, Zabimaru. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh, yeah, and I, I will probably just try to sh uh, push the um, bitrate up to max. Uh, why are you? Why? Why? Why is this all broken? Why did I not? Oh yes. Okay, I did not connect any of these things. Okay, we have to. <laughs> Go ahead and just do this. Okay, great. Um, yeah, I just I just did the things over here. Hmm. How am I going to do this? So I was. The thing is, we have to apply virtual mass to this. Um, virtual mass. We have to apply maximum mass, and I feel like apply to all. I'm going to keep it this way. Um, if we go ahead and check out the center of mass now. My goodness. You know what? Apply to all. Let's get out of my face. Thanks. So yeah, it's still there. Um, and this should be fine. But this will only work when the engines or the thrusters are attached. So this is what we were busy with last time. Um, lining these thrusters up with the beams and whatnot. Then we got completely sidetracked last stream. That's why I, I didn't upload anything to YouTube yet. Um, because there was a lot of sidetracking and things. Uh, but yeah. I think this is, this is what we're gonna continue on doing. Just to get these thrusters to attach. Question is, will this be enough? Uh, because I think one of these box thrusters kick out about 500,000 thrust. I think. I don't know if the new changes. I have no idea how the new changes affect. Because I know there are uh, changes towards box thrust or any thruster whatsoever. I'm not too sure like how badly they are affected. Um, and also we probably have to do something regarding these things over here. Uh, but what we can do is go ahead and just switch off m m center of mass. Um, I think the best thing what we can do, okay, so this is 
a mil, two mil, three mil, four million. And I think, I mean, let's go check. Let's go check. Please don't pop up here. Yep, you, you decided to pop up there. Thanks. You are awesome. What is today? Helen Joseph's 11, 11, 10, 11, 6 birthday. All right, congratulations. Um, not to sound any, not insensitive or anything, but I really don't know who you are, and South Africa never, ever taught us that. Thrusters, it was just mainly South African uh, history. All right, so uh, this is now, I'm looking at the wiki. I'm just pointing it out. I'm looking at the wiki. Um, and this is before, I mean, they don't, they don't, they don't even have the freaking um, thrusters. Uh, actually, I can probably do this. There we go. They don't even have a picture of the fla plasma thrusters. It's just a placeholder, they say. Uh, but over here is box thrusters. Yet, uh, remember, I don't know if this is correct or not. Um, but yeah, about 500,000 thrust. If we look at the box thruster, uh, the um, plasma thruster, though, um, it provides 3.5 mil. The smallest one, I think. The smallest plasma thruster setup. Uh, 3.5, and it doubles up when it's warmed up. And I think there's a se 60 second warm up. Yeah, it will take 60 seconds to warm up. Once it's fully charged, it will begin to warm up, uh, which will take about 60 seconds. So once 60 seconds are hit, it will double up its um, thrust. So you will get about 7 mil out of the smallest setup. Now it comes down to this. We have uh, two of you says eight. We have eight. So it's five, one million, two million, three million, four million thrust. So we have a um, plasma thrust of worth, but a cold one worth a little bit, like 500,000 more worth. Um, so, and each box thruster uses uh, four. 41 propellant so if we go and take that propellant which is 41.28 uh, times that by 8 so it will consume 330.24 propellant um, and this dude the, at the, I think this is the smallest one the base plasma thruster will consume 598 um, so it is already these box thrusters are much more fuel efficient in terms of that it's about a 200 300 less around there maybe 200, 270 270 less okay so that's that and now electricity or energy per second is there a difference eps eps electricity energy i don't know uh so we seeing at 210 electricity so that's 210 times eight that's 1,600, which is more than a plasma thruster, which is 1,5. But it's only slightly, only about 100 more, which is not an issue. It's not an issue. Now, this is what I'm trying to tell everybody, especially in the um, Kabot's Discord, is I, I was going off all of this info over here, like what is used where and whatnot. Um, and i don't know how updated the wiki is um so yeah just you know trying to put that out there trying to say like listen that's how i got my info regarding the pathfinder okay how good are we we're still actually good that's good um now the the thing is how much weight how much mm, now, this is what I'm kind of wondering. Um, isn't there a thing where we can figure out... Okay, I have X amount of mass. How many thrusters do I need to push this mass? If all of these crates are filled up. Because I think each row over here is 100. So is 1, 2, 300 crates. And this thing is hitting not nearly enough the voxel volume. It wasn't even hitting the limit. And it was already like this. And all it needed is just the engines. Uh, then the cockpit would have been uh, like beautified, beautified, beautified. Um, and then the plates would come in and then it would be done. Um, obviously, the extra, what do you call it? The extra um, reactors, the these, these generators, fuel chambers, fuel rods, 
those things to power the engines. Um, that's kind of what I'm trying to get at. Yeah. So I think this is fine for now. This the only way we can what we can do is just test. You know, get this thing into flying status and test it. Um, and this is the stream ship. So every time when I'm going to stream, this is what I'm going to. This is what we're going to work on up until when it's finished. Um, then I want to see if we can get it built and just go mine. Because if you guys don't know, for those who aren't here on streams or whatnot, quickly going to show you guys. Um, I've written a code for each of these um, lasers. Now there was somebody who said on one of my videos, like or a lot, of, I think a few people, well, two, a couple, a couple of people, said they feel like the uh, mining lasers are a waste of energy. They would rather go out and mine with their hands. It's like, yeah, sure, go ahead, be 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 that person. Uh, I'm not going to stop you if you find it. And it's actually kind of theoretical. Theor it's nice. It's it's nice to do. Um, but sometimes I'm like, listen, I need money and I need now. Um, and mining lasers, I think it's a way, the way to go, but you, I want it to be more efficient. So what I've done is I've written code over here. You sound different. Really? I don't know if anybody can hear that, but I like, I like, I wish we could just switch it off though. <laughs> it's annoying. Um, okay, so the first thing I've done is think of uh, being power efficient, or yeah, power efficient. So, uh, we have on the sides, come on, on the sides, we have um, three generators attached to one fuel chamber. So that's three, six at the top, six at the bottom, uh, six on this top, and six on this bottom. Uh, these six are for the that uh mining laser so th there will be it would have its own six that one will have its own six that and that although yes they are all on the uh, on the same grid um because the range finder i only want i only want one range finder because it's easier to work with um to be honest otherwise i would need four and then well i mean we could probably do that probably but i will i will have to think about it but anyways um, so the thing is, we have a code. We have a code over here, uh, which says that if the range finder, which is below us, is on, then go to line three. Uh, if the range finder has a longer range than uh, a shorter range than twenty, switch on the mining lasers. If it's longer, switch them off. Um, actually, I could have just written that differently but i will i will play around with it off stream or off camera or whatever but um that's kind of what i wanted um the re the whole reason why why is the game doing that like why 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 is it switching off like that uh, this is not the first uh, like on the other ship i'm working on it does exactly the same thing kind of makes me angry i don't know if anything's bolted down or whatnot but anyways um so yeah we have our rangefinder over here, and this is kind of what I was talking about. Um, the other codes each have their own code. Well, that's why there's extra four YOLO chips there. Each have their own code. Um, basically, I want it also to follow where the line is being broken. Okay, so if we are approaching an asteroid, just imagine we are an asteroid. So we got we, we're breaking the line. This is where we are breaking it, and as we're getting closer and closer. All right, just, you know, we're flying closer and closer to an asteroid. Suddenly they switch on and they go to the asteroid. And as we get closer, holy crap, they suck out a lot of energy. And as we get closer, hmm, you guys are not working with me. Is that, you know what? I'm just quickly going to put a wall of batteries there so that we have the energy to showcase this. Because now I'm just looking like a a, a, a dumbass. <laughs> There's no better way to put it. <laughs> I just look like an idiot. I think that's a better word. Or lack of better words, an idiot. Uh, right, let's go ahead and select all of y'all. That, 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 that. And let's do that. And let's do that. A wall of batteries. 
Because why not? There, yeah, get 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 nailed. Okay, let's go ahead and switch this on once again. Here we go. We are on. Now, here we go. I'm breaking the line. We're closer than 20 meters. They switch on and they follow me. Come on. Well, this is interesting. Well, now you do it. There's a lag in the system. There's lag in the system somewhere because now they're going to fire up again. Yes? No? Maybe so? Okay, you know what we're going to do? See this one? This one over here? Get out. <laughs> That's just to switch on and off the lasers. Just like, get out. Okay. So we're here. See, now this is what I mean by lag in the system. The, um... Yeah, they were supposed to do that a long time ago. Something changed. Because now I'm getting closer. They should have changed position by now. Why are you guys lagging? Now, this is what... Hmm. Very, very interesting. See, it's like this is supposed to be a position change. Now they change. Why are you guys... You know, we have to investigate this. Because this is not this is not working out for me. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh my goodness. There we go. Alright. You What are you stuck on? Okay. See it runs through all those. Go to one, go to two, if... And they all should be running at exactly the same time. Yeah, they all are going to exactly the same time. Uh, how many are there? Okay, there's more than ten. If there was exactly ten, then I could just double up with if statements and just finish the if statement. Because if you say something equals this, if something, then something, if something, then something, else something, and put in an else statement, maybe at the back of it, that could work. Um, then this is kind of why I don't really want to do this stuff on stream or on YouTube or anything, because it is kind of boring to figure out this whole issue. Um, but we can probably finish the else statement. So if we say, if this is true, then do that else go back to one maybe yeah i think that would have been a better thing because then we just tell it to go back as quickly as possible we can probably do that quickly i don't think about it this now my brain's cooking it's like three in the morning my brain's cooking We can probably just go ahead and do this and then I'm probably going to end off the stream because it everything looks fine. I just it was just basically a small stream, it was not supposed to be something very long. Um so uh, don't don't wait for the chip. Now what happens if if that if the range is less than twenty and more than nineteen, then that should get that position. I wonder, how does the else... Else go to... Okay, now that's fine. End. Because it already goes to one. Else go to... One. Uh, end. I wonder if end will work. I'm um, okay. Let's see if this and this. Like I said, if it's 
larger than 20 and s no smaller than 19 but larger than 18 do this then go to two wonder if an and statement and go to two else go to one so go i wonder if this will work go to back to the one on top of you yeah because uh, you, we want to keep scanning where the yeah where the um uh, the object is basically so this is M um mlrt mining laser right Bro, something right no i don't know i don't know my naming conventions so, so let's try this else go to two end i don't know where the end statement should go like it should end then else or else then end don't know where that goes so but this is a way to test out else go to three and you know what i should do can i instead of typing out the whole damn thing just go ahead and do that go to four go to five It's six. Uh, let's see. Stream so good. Stream so good. Uh, no wait. Go to six. Go to eight. There we go. Fixed it. That's what I should delete. But you should not be that. Uh, go to eight, six, seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Yeah, stream still good. I almost forgot about it. It'd be good to forget about it a little. Go to... 11. I don't know if this will work. But we have to test it out somehow. Okay, so this is... Which one is it? M-L-R-T... M-L-R-L-T. Okay, so it's this one. Yeah, so we have to keep an eye on this one. Let's go ahead. Let's do this. Don't switch off. Why you do that? You're making me sad, man. Ah, push the button. Ugh. Why? Not you guys. No, it's not you. There we go. You're on. keep an eye on this one yeah it's not do yeah it's not doing a thing it's not doing a single thing well this has been a waste get out of here I think if you scroll yeah if you scroll fast enough you can actually fling them away like flick them <laughs> which is hilarious Uh, see, now it's stuck there. That's not good. Yeah, that is... That's the issue. It's gonna go back and forth, back and forth, up until we get very close. That's the thing. We have to get very close. Well, not close. At the furthest point. Now, this is all we can do. Is This is the way we test. And we're keeping an eye on that one. I see that one works immediately. Mm. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why did you guys switch on? That, you no. Know, oh, yes. Okay, I forgot. <laughs> I, I did reset the whole thing. Goodbye. Alright, let's uh, test this again. I wish I actually could know how far that is. Hmm, you know what we should have done? I actually grab that thing and put it here and measure it. See, they work, but not fast enough. Yeah, so that code is rubbish. Uh, oh well. Okay. We get closer. Let's see, they're not updating the way I thought they would. Okay. And now it's back to sitting there. Okay, so there is an issue of the code, and I do not like it. All right. But anyways, um, yeah. Just gonna stand here on the, just end the simulation, and then just gonna end off here. Um, but yeah, this has been a good test. I do appreciate the uh, the speeds and whatnot, um, the consistency. There's no drop frames, nothing. If, even if I do this, there should be a lot of frames going around here, and there's nothing going on. Um, so yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, stream looks steady. I'm happy about that. I'm gonna try to increase the bitrate and see how that goes uh, we will be back soon again with more starbase we're going to continue on working on this ship over here i uh, just want to check if the wife did not message me no she did not um, but anyways people that is going to be it for today's stream thank you so much for joining me here on starbase hope you guys did enjoy today's episode and today's stream and uh, yeah make sure to check the description you guys on youtube if you guys want any um idea what my channel is and when i stream some starbase i hope to see you all there that's all for me hope you guys have a great one take care goodbye